I'm not really one for learning through Zoom, so it doesn't feel like I'm retaining as much information that I should. But I think I've still come like a long way. I feel like I'd rather stay, like if there was a possibility to do actual clinicals in person, because I was hoping throughout this experience I'd figure out like what exactly I wanted to specialize in and I'm still really debating what I like and I don't like and I don't know because I don't have that experience in person or I'm not able to see um, how everything plays out in the hospital. I'm kind of scared but that's that's how it is. I feel as of right now I don't feel prepared to graduate that's why I'm trying to work like as hard as I can, try to focus on um, my lecture classes. If we had in-person clinicals, it would take a rough estimate around like eight to like 12 hour shifts in the hospital, you're always on your feet. And for online, since we're only staring at a screen, it'll only take around like four hours of my time. But it's gotta get old for them. It's gotta be hard for them. But last night I had a conversation with one of my colleagues from a different nursing school their students haven't even been able to come back to campus. We were one of the pilot groups at EDSA this summer to bring our students back into our simulation center. So they had real experience, not just thinking about it, not just sitting at home watching it, but actually doing it. The way that your pump and your tubing works, where do you want to connect what to? In EDSA, um, I'm pretty proud of the fact that our faculty, staff, and students have been able to take advantage of what we know about technology, being able to embrace um, uh, virtual experiences. The online clinicals were kind of unexpected. I was really expecting the in-person experience as along with, you know, everyone else. But I'm really glad that we were able to, you know, go to lab, have experience with like mannequins, still do our video validations and actually meet our professors in person. I think that's just like really vital and I'm just really glad to be able to practice my skills. There are some schools that the students have not had contact with a patient or have not had a simulation in person since March. All across the United States, Edson, we are so fortunate that we've been able to bring them back for in-person experiences. We've been able to do testing and have them learn to think like a nurse in terms of that. And our graduating students, the bulk of them, have been in patient care situations doing their last semester of preceptorship. And you know, like, I mean, I trust the nursing program here. I trust my professors and I believe that they'll find another way for us to be able to um, ready us for next year in which I'll graduate.